All right. We're on a Wednesday. We're out here at Casino Motorsports Park, and it is a decent day to start out the first day of December. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. And that was my first attempt at really shifting into second. It was a little sloppy. I tapped a little bit of rear brake so I didn't mess up. So we tried something a little new and I know it's in the dark. Could it be better? Absolutely. But I know the next time I do it, it will be a lot better, or at least somewhat better. Last night I uploaded my review of this bike after 2,000 miles with the Stroker Big Boar. And I'm going to combine this with another video that I shot the other night. Uh, what I got, what happened was, is I got behind a farmer's vehicle hauling some cotton round bales uh, to their facility and it looked like it was snowing. I couldn't believe how much material that they were losing off of it. So I'm going to put that video here next. And I'm going to break off here because i got to focus on this. This is a high deer traffic area. But I'm going to put that next and that's just going to be the end of this uh, moto vlog. And uh, I'll see you next time after that. Recording. Okay, I'm waiting on a train as usual. And... I'm just trying to practice a, a little drill real quick here I'm going to share with you. I think I might have read this somewhere, but I started practicing it the other day and I don't remember where it was, so props to whoever suggested this. I'm going to show that um, cotton video after this and not, the, uh, not after I broke off a minute ago, but I'm sitting here on a slight uh, incline and I've got my my parking light on here so my brake light isn't coming on but I'm just kind of learning I'm, I'm trying to put that muscle memory and the feel of the the rear brake into into practice so I've got a little bit of pressure on the brake pedal and I'm rolling back I don't know if you can tell it but I've got it slightly pressed and then I'm feeling the slowdown that I'm getting from the brake. So I'm starting to gauge that pressure and where I start to get some efficacy on it. So obviously I got the other foot down and I'm just starting to just develop that feel. And that's a bunch of stuff in that truck bed trailer there. But anyway, I'm just sitting here practicing, feeling that pressure that I'm getting out of the rear brake on this incline. I know it's it's nothing to do with the orientation that I have. I'm just slightly rolling back. I've got my hands on the bars and I'm just feeling, all right, where is that brake engaging? So I just wanted to share that real quick. That's something that I've been doing just a few days here just to kind of feel that. And it seems to be helping me out a little bit. Now we'll do the cotton video and then we'll see you next time. Okay, I know it's dark, but it looks like it's snowing almost right now because I am following from a distance a truck carrying bales of cotton I don't know if you can see it on the roadway here. How are they making any money if they're throwing it all over the road? I've seen it along the side of my road. Oh good, they're turning. We'll be able to get a, a little bit of a look at these things, these bales. Yeah. 
normally I would think about passing them, but I can't see around them. Okay. So there's these bales of cotton. Anyway, I thought that would be interesting. <laughs>